guys welcome back to my channel today I'm gonna be doing the what's in my purse video for you guys so sorry for like not posting a lot if you guys watched my last video which was my birthday haul you guys should totally go check it out cuz it was pretty good um I said that my laptop was getting fixed and it got fixed well it actually didn't get fixed they gave me a refund for it and I got a new computer so that's all good and Literally, it's been crazy this week. I was going to do a different video for you guys, but things have just been literally crazy. So hopefully next week, I literally only have three days of school, and I, I have practically a five-day weekend. So hopefully I can get a lot of videos in for you guys. At least get the filming in so I can have the footage so I can edit it and upload them whenever I want to. So just sorry for that. I'm not leaving. I literally hate like taking one of these long breaks away from doing videos because... It's just not good for me because then I feel so awkward coming back into it like three weeks later like where have you been? <laughs> so sorry for that. Hopefully it's not really going to happen anymore since school's finally kind of like clearing out. <sighs> Two more months guys. We can do this. We got this. Two more months and we're out. So yes, as I said today I'm doing the what's in my purse video. So let's just get started shall we? Okay so my purse is this and it is the fossil I don't know the name of like the type but it's a fossil purse and it looks like this I don't know if the camera's like picking up on like all the colors but it's just like this it has the like little handles but I got this purse last year when I was going to New York just to show you guys there's really nothing like special about the bag that's practically how it looks. It just has like pockets on the side as a zipper and everything. It's your practically average bag. And the thing about it, I love this is that it still has that new leather smell. Like you guys know when you buy, I don't know, what can you buy that has that leather smell? Like if you buy new boots or something and it has that new leather smell, my purse still has that smell. And I've had it practically, it's about to be a year this summer. It's about to be a year that I've had this purse. Okay, so let's just get into the video. So the first thing that I keep in my purse is just my wallet. And this is my wallet. It is a Vera Bradley wallet. And I don't know if the camera is picking up on it, but it is just a really bright coral color. And then it has the little wristlet at the end. And it's detachable too, so I can take it off, which I really love because I'm going to be driving really soon. So if I don't really need this on my wallet... I can take it and put it on my keys so I can carry my keys like this. So I actually absolutely love that they made it detachable so you can use it for multiple reasons, not just your wallet. So to show you guys my wallet, um, I literally, you can still buy this wallet if you guys like it or anything. Um, I got it from Bear Bradley again and it's still, I bought it a couple of weeks ago so it's recently new. So it's still going to be out there. I literally just went to the mall yesterday and like saw it. So if you guys want to buy it, you guys can. This is the inside of my wallet the zipper part is just right here where I keep my change and then on the sides it's just cards where you put your cards and then the other side just cards I have a lot of gift cards in here and receipts and stuff for my birthday so um, yeah so I literally love this wallet guys it is just a lifesaver I was in the need to buy a new wallet and it's not too expensive it was around I think it was around $50 um, I actually didn't know it was $50 and when I saw how much she charged me I was like mad but then I finally realized that's how much it cost so that is my first thing that I keep in here second thing I keep in my purse of course is my phone can't go anywhere without my phone you guys have seen my phone before I showed it in a video so yep my phone next thing that I like to keep in here is some type of a lip product for like moisturizing my lips I just like to keep this mini Vaseline lip therapy it's just the original one I could not find the rosy one um which made me very mad because I really wanted the rosy pinky one if you guys know it so it's just it looks like this you guys can get it anywhere I think I got mine at Walmart <laughs> you guys can literally find this anywhere any drugstore or whatever Next thing that I keep in here are just some headphones. I have to have headphones with me because whenever I go places, I'm not always going to agree on the music selection that's going on on the car, in the car. So these are just plain old Apple headphones. I'm actually 
thinking, not thinking, I'm actually wanting to buy Beats headphones in the near future and when I mean future I mean in a couple of months because I'm going to be doing some traveling and I kind of need some good headphones so. But yes, I keep these and I literally use these for everything, I use them in school, just, they're just plain headphones guys, nothing special, nothing special. Next thing I like to keep in here are just some sunglasses. These are just cheap sunglasses because thing with me, I can't buy expensive stuff because I end up losing it. So I kind of just like to buy like cheap sunglasses. It's not like they're cheap. Like they've been lasting me for years. So these are just some sunglasses because it's getting sunny now and I just, I have to have something that can block the sun out. Okay guys, so the next thing I like to keep is just some lotion because I always forget to put lotion on before I leave which is really annoying but it's like it's me like I just don't put lotion on. I don't know why and then when you get in the car you look all the way down you're like whoa like I'm ashy so I have to have lotion with me and this is just the French lavender and honey from Bath and Body Works it is just the mini version and I absolutely love this it's not too like of a strong scent because I know some people don't like strong scents. I like strong scents, but I feel like it's a really calming scent that, you know. And the thing is, people always ask for lotion. Whenever they smell your lotion, they're like, oh my gosh, can I have some? I'm like, um, it's not mine. But that's just what I get. Next thing I like to keep in here is just a hair tie. Hair tie bobby pins. I just like to have them with me because you never know when you need to put your hair up, put your hair out of your face, so... And next thing I like to keep in here is just a glasses, my wipe for my glasses because if you guys don't know, I wear glasses 24-7, I, I wear them in sports, I wear them, I wear them for everything, I never take my glasses off, I don't have contacts which I really think I'm going to have to get in the future but I have, I wear glasses for everything and if you have glasses then you know how annoying it is when you have like a smudge or fingerprint or like something on your glass on your lens. This came with my glasses and if you guys are wondering what like brand my glasses are, they are Tekka or Tika. I pronounce them Tekka. It's T-E-K-A. Um, Tekka Eyewear and I guess it's made in Soho, New York and I literally love my glasses. I got them about two years ago I guess. So yes, I like to keep this in my bag. I like to keep this in my backpack whenever I'm going to school. And I just literally take it in and out. I have two now so. And this one is just great because like the material is really nice. And um, if you have glasses, it's not good to like get tissues or your clothing to like wipe your glass lens, your lens because it will scratch it and eventually the scratches will just add up and up and it's gonna mess up your eyesight and everything like that. I think that's what happened with my old glasses is that they were literally scratched up so much so I like to use the appropriate things on my lenses. Okay, after that um, lens let lesson we had there. So last thing I practically keep in my purse is just some type of lip product. Um, Normally, I will carry lipstick in here if I'm going out and I have lipstick on. I always end up drinking something, eating something, and kind of take it off. So, always good to reapply it. This is just a CoverGirl Smoochies um, lipstick thingy, I guess. It just, it looks like this. It's kind of like in this kind of like coral color, like a deep coral, I guess I should say. I've had this for years, guys, like seriously. When that is it for this video guys I hope you guys enjoy it it was just a really quick video just to kind of show you guys what's in my purse and hopefully I will be doing tons more videos like these if you guys like these type of videos don't forget to, don't forget to give it a thumbs up and subscribe down below to see more videos and I'm pretty sure that's it comment down below if you guys have any questions about anything and if you have any video requests, comment down below. Go subs go follow me on Instagram, Twitter, Tumblr, Pinterest, Pinterest. That is it for this video, guys. I hope you guys enjoyed it. And I will see you guys in my next one. And as always, be your own kind of beautiful. Bye.